This is your interim superintendent, and this is news from around the district in a Millbrook minute. Hey, Blazer Nation. This week at the high school, winter sports are back. This week, our boys, JV, and varsity teams will travel to Highland on Monday afternoon for a scrimmage. Wednesday, our girls teams open their season on the road to FBR, and on Friday, they have their season home opener against Pine Plains. The girls' JV game at 415, varsity at 6, while the boys open their Mahal schedule with a road game at Pine Plains. On Tuesday, we have a model UN trip to New York City and U.S. history field trip to FBR. This Friday, we have another school-wide assembly. Our presenters asked if we could keep this topic vague, so I'll honor that and simply say it's a powerful assembly you don't want to miss. Have a great week. Here at Millbrook Middle School, we've been catching uh, students, faculty, and staff it, it being kind throughout the building. Uh, in this coming weeks, we're beginning our winter athletics and looking to the future. Uh, this week, we will be having hour of code for our sixth, seventh, and eighth graders throughout the building. And now with news from Alden Place, Mr. Lipka. Greetings, Mr. Lipka from Alden Place. Uh, and just quickly, our winter chorus concert is on Wednesday this week. Uh, Thursday is the Kindness Club meeting. Friday is Junior Interact. And a reminder to all, all families, the fundraiser for the movie Elf is planned for next Sunday, December 11. And take it away, Elm Drive, Mrs. O'Connell. Greetings from Elm Drive. Um, I just want to congratulate the second graders who did an amazing job caroling at the Parade of Lights on Friday. Uh, this week, we have our Golden Spoon Positive Behavior Cafeteria Incentive in full swing. The kids are very excited to be getting tickets and prizes with that. And don't forget, we have our Parents' Night Out fundraiser for next Wednesday, December 14th. And I hope to see you there and have a good week. Good morning, Millbrook Central School District. As a supervisor of student services, one of my many goals is, is to support our students' social and emotional learning. Last week, we had guest speakers join us from NAMI, the National Alliance on Mental Illness, to present to our 8th through 12th grade students on ending the silence on mental illness. As activities and events continue to occur here at Millbrook Central School District, Surveys will be dispersed to students and teachers seeking feedback on our SEL events and activities. Stay tuned as we look forward to future SEL events here at Millbrook Central School District, as I now turn it over to our Supervisor of Pupil and Personnel Services. Hi, Millbrook families. I'm Alex Janowski, and as the Supervisor of Pupil Personnel Services, I work to oversee the Special Education Department and our school nurses. Currently in special education, we are working to complete a compliance review for the state, which examines the area of transition services. This helps us to examine the delivery of our services to ensure we are providing appropriate supports for our students. Now on to Ms. Watkins. Thank you, Ms. Chanowski. Hi, everyone. I am the Executive Director of Instruction and Community Relations. You've been receiving emails from me. I apologize for bombarding you, but we truly thank everyone who's had taken the opportunity to respond back to our strategic plan surveys. Thank you so much. I also just wanted to highlight last week, I had the opportunity to be with our mock trial um, students from the high school and highlight an opportunity for them to um, engage in civic responsibility in the town of Unionville with Justice Paul Panko. If you have a student in mock trial, check out what um, that was all about. And now I turn it over to Mr. Garcia. Good morning, everyone. This is Elliot Garcia, Assistant Superintendent. Thank you, uh, Dr. Watkins. So we have a number of things going on in the district. Uh, shout out to our facilities and operations team. We've been working hard to winterize the district and prepare for some uh, winter weather whenever it comes. Uh, we also have a number of vacant positions coming out of the business and personnel offices. So if you know anybody that's open to work or looking for some extra work, uh, we have vacancies from administration and teaching positions all the way to, super, um, um, to support services um, with uh, no experience required. So if you know anybody that's open to work, please have them check out our website under our district employment opportunities or give us a call. We'd love to talk to you. Thanks. And uh, Ms. Hernandez. So as the team has said, we have many up, exciting upcoming events that we look forward to seeing you at. I want to thank everyone who has participated in gathering information for our strategic plan. There will be many more opportunities to collaborate in the near future, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Go Blazers! Thank you, everyone.